All right, hello everybody. Today is finally the day. It is Wednesday, May 20th. Um, if you hear an incessant noise, it's people doing a drive-by and now there's a train. It's the middle of um, the COVID-19 crisis and people do drive-bys in my neighborhood like every 15 minutes. That's not true, but um, it happens a lot. And there's also a train. Anyway, uh, my baby is finally here. I can't even believe like she's in this box. Um, I've been waiting. That was my face. It's fine. I've been waiting since um, July of 2019. So about 10 and a half months that I've been waiting for this baby. I am so excited. I can hardly stand it. Um, but I'm also so nervous because I never got like final photos of her. Um, so this box got really beat up and that's you know obviously no fault of the sellers but I'm just hoping that the artist did take enough precaution to like make sure that she would be okay in the event of that happening because big yikes also this took almost 14 days to get here which is again this says priority mail obviously no fault of the sellers but it's just like life has really been against this whole thing the entire time from the start so we've got lots of bubble wrap um I have to say, this box smells really nice. <laughs> it's such an odd thing to notice, but it does. Oh gosh, I hope I didn't just show the kit. I'm gonna cover up the kit. Okay, updates, I can't show anything. There, there are the feet. <laughs> but here's her birth certificate. Um, and so Baggy has a Pampers diaper in it and a little green passy with a hedgehog. Another train? Are you serious? Goodness gracious. Um, so I did manage to, if you saw my haul video for her, I did find her a lovey the other day. It's a unicorn. And here's her little lamby blanket ready for her. So I'm gonna, um, I can feel her face is right here. Oh my god, I'm so excited to see her. ready for this. All right, bring her closer. She sits so nicely. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh my God. <laughs> I can't believe this is finally happening. Oh my gosh. <clears throat> All right. Okay. <gasps> oh, that's my baby. The number of times I've watched Reborn box opening. <gasps> oh, wow. Oh, her little outfit has strawberries on the butt. Very cute. Okay, let's see this view. Oh my gosh. <gasps> She's beautiful. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> She's got such long legs. <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god. Let me see if I can... um. Hmm. Let me bring her up to you, actually. Look at those legs. They're so chunky. And her feet. Oh, her little toes. Oh, she's perfect. Her little toes are separated. Well, all of her, um, her big toes are separated, which means I think I can put, like, flip-flops on her and sandals and stuff. Look at that foot. Oh, oh my goodness. She's so soft. And her, her skin is perfect. It's very close to mine, which is precious but just in general it's a really nice really nice look okay let's get to those arms I don't think she has anything covering up her face so I have to be really careful okay there's one arm and she has full limbs oh gosh that's a little it's a little tight that arm I would like it to be a little bit looser possibly I might loosen it but there's one she is so chunky oh my gosh Hands. Yeah, I think I might loosen her arms a bit. They're just a little tight. I would like to be able to move her a little bit better. But that hand is gorgeous. And her finger oh my gosh, her fingernails. They're not like aggressively painted. They're just a nice soft painting on them. I'm gonna move you guys closer. Oh gosh. Oh my god. <laughs> 
having a moment and my phone is trying to freak out on us. You good, tripod? Okay. There are her arms. Her little feet. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited. <sighs> this has been ten and a half months. I could have a real baby that had grown out of this size by the time I know. You know what I mean? Like, if I had had a real child, they would already be... see her hair. I'm so nervous about her hair. Okay. <sighs> Ready? Oh. What a sweet girl. Her hair is not as dark as I would like it to be. I would like it to be a couple of shades darker. Um, so that's a little sad. But I think... And her eyelashes are a little bit too light as well. But it is very well rooted. At least it seems to be. I think. And her face is beautiful. Her little ears. Oh my gosh. What a sweet girl. So this is the three month June asleep kit. And yeah, I'm, I've just been completely in love with this kit since I saw it. And yeah, I just, I love it. <laughs> I think, I don't know, I'm not in love with her hair. That's so disappointing, because that was like the thing that held her up for so long. But I think I'm gonna brush it out and wet it down and see how I feel about it after that. Because I have a feeling I might, oh, if I'm feeling real bold, I might even try and trim it. Because it's just a little bit long for her, I think. You know, she's a newborn. But as of right now, her name is Ruby. But that may change. I'm not exactly sure what her name is yet. Um, I thought of the name Mabel, or, I don't know, she's so fair and light, maybe she'll be Prim. I had thought about naming her Prim after From the Hunger Games, but then I told myself I couldn't do that, but she is very Primrose-esque. Alright, I'm gonna brush her out, I'm gonna change her outfit, and I'm gonna bond with her a little bit and, and just hold her, and, um, yeah, thank you for watching, and I will definitely be back with more videos of her soon. Bye.